The New York Simulation Center is now open for business. Okay, ready to shock. Clear the patient. Everyone clear? All right. Shocking now. Okay, continue CPR, please. We had to be prepared to act decisively to deal with the human element, and I think a facility like this will prepare our people to be nimble and effective, forward-thinking, and aggressive as they confront challenges that inevitably are going to occur. As you can see, this new center occupies the entire third floor of Bellevue Hospital's C&D building and will be able to serve as a national leader in the simulation training that has become a fundamental component in the training of physicians, nurses, and emergency response workers. And how, how does this compare in terms of your role and what you're able to do today? I think that this is really beneficial as far as teamwork goes. Um, in order to do it in a setting um, outside of the hospital, it makes you feel a lot more comfortable and you can gain um, confidence for the real practical setting. Let's get an IV oxygen pain. and a monitor. I am especially pleased that Downtown Hospital will have the ability to utilize this facility to train its emergency response team as well. That local organizations uh, will be able to train here and that nursing students at Borough of Manhattan Community College will also be taking advantage of the training that is provided here. None can compare it to this center in terms of the design and the functionality in the sophistication of the technology that you'll soon see, in the scope of the programs that are going to be provided, in the expertise of our staff, this is truly an amazing center.